So I was just talking to Willie about vomiting. Well, because in, during your sync test, it sounded explicitly like you were about to yak, and uh, I wasn't too fond of that. You're not a you're not a big fan of the yakking. No. So here's the thing about I, li- me. I like a good yak, the animal. Here's the here's the wow. What objects are dropping around the office in what, Castle? What, Super what Beast, was that? We don't know what they are. That sounded like something light and plastic. That was behind us. Almost like a part of a microphone, or well, no. your your something important, something that was necessary Every- to recording. Everything in my pants is still here. Okay, well, um, did part of your mask come with you? Did anything? No. My mask? Yeah. Anything? My there? sleep mask? Anything? No. My sleep mask is made out of silicon, man. It okay. wouldn't make a noise if it fell down. Okay, all right. So we're fine. We keep going until um, it falls down around us. Yeah, so let's talk about me throwing up. I was worried that you were going to vomit, and then LP while vomit all is all over your body. I would, I, I, I not, could do that I if I wanted. I was not down for that, so... So here's the, and here's the, the, the comeback I had to what, Wooly's what, statement. What do I not know? Uh, it's nice, but there's, I, we read this last time. Yeah, yeah, we it's, did. It's so She's fun. so perfect. Uh, Her might have... Chondria. Oh, it's just making me so hot. And now it's in a different way. But I have a buildup. Uh, I can only remember one or two situations in which uh, I had a hard ass vomit out of nowhere. Hmm. Right? Uh, once was when I was a young boy and I played that game with my older brother where you go down to the park and you go down to the merry go round and you're like, I wonder how hard your older brother can fucking hard spin this shit. Hmm. Um, go back to your room for a second. Oh, no. This game has no 180 degree quick turn, which oh, is totally baffling to me. Uh, the other time was a few weeks ago on a stream. Where I decided to sip a tiny piece of coconut water. Yeah. That, you wanted that, to go down here? Can you kick that ladder? Can you do something with that ladder? I can probably climb right the fuck down. Okay. There's a ladder going down. Okay, right. Yeah, I'm 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 gonna go check the other doors though. Once you're finished with your vomiting, we'll start talking yeah. about this. Go ahead. Uh, in which I had what may have been four droplets of coconut water, mm-hmm. which is poison. Yep. But I seen it. If you can see that clip, you can see that like I have a, I have like a like a a, a build up like a, oh, mm-hmm. oh, and you have you have a part in your tum tums is just like, uh oh, right. So I have about you see thirty seconds. Of, form of, about of to throw pure, of power build up. Uh, you know? The merry-go-round thing. I did not have thirty seconds. I was at the dinner table when it yeah. was. I had one second, it's, and it was like I don't. Bleh. It's funny because you know there the lore goes in in the West Indies and in Grenada in particular that you gotta drink coconut water because it's good for your daughter. You know you gotta. You What's gotta, the pl- what? Drinking coconut water is good for your daughter, and and so whose daughter? Are you pregnant? It's terrible. It's co- it's disgusting. And I don't understand. I don't I've, understand this Grenadian meme. I never understood it anyway. Uh, but I will tell you that I have drank it and felt like not vomiting, but I felt it's really disgusting. It's bad. So I understand. Caution, um, high voltage. That so, should say danger, high voltage. So what 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 I do know is that in this game. We've been told uh, that coconut water is still poisonous. Yeah. Uh, oh. Oh. Oh boy. You guys. That is tech. They have tech on them. Yeah. They look really good. So, um, there's tons of things to observe. Yes. Uh, so apparently she has billions of dialogue. Yes. So you need to. What the fuck? Why am I stuck in the check? Your surroundings like crazy, go nuts, and you need to. Will do. Um, multiply. Talk to things and multiply. Oh, analyze Uh-oh. things. Oh, will he help? Well, I may, that thing may have happened. That thing where I forget what I'm doing. What are you doing? Uh. Shoot. Oh, there gee. you go. Dodge cool. and shoot and dodge and shoot. Full boy. Um, couple of other little factoids. We missed I'm... that black card, unfortunately. Yeah. In the part one. Well, here's the thing about this: the multiple endings that you gotta get. Uh, apparently the requirements are very high. Very high for what you need to do to get them. Um, like, it's absurd so, and it's stupid. I think we're gonna give What's it our this? best. It's connected to the fish. shot. It's a lever at the gate. Oh yeah, let's, let, let's. And I'm gonna pay attention to you know what what we should be looking at a little bit, mm-hmm. but but we're not gonna get it. So so. But so I think if we don't get it, give up your hopes. I think guess what? If we don't get it, we'll just get it anyway. 
Oh, what? If you know what I mean. I don't. I don't know what you mean. I don't think there's any chance that we'll finish this LP not seeing the good ending somehow. Somehow? Creatures made a hole. Even if it means we see the bad one first. Oh, no. So you, we're going to replay the whole game? The whole game. That was an unfortunate goddamn camera angle. Yeah, and that's going to continue to be a problem. But what else could you do back in, in these days? Oh, that's what's happening. You can see the little alfalfa head right there. So, wow, you complete- wow! So the other thing you need to be aware of while you fight these little face beastoids is, uh, that, um, triangle on the menu screen will bring up your flavor text for your Damn near option. anything. Exactly, so stuff that we wanted to know, like how much stronger a gun was, or... Wait, what? It disappeared. Unidentified objects that are just gonna be a bunch of question marks you need hit, to hit the triangle, and that'll tell you where to go. Uh, getting rid of the tonfa is also a good idea. Oh, I can hit, uh, I, hit I can hit triangle to shoot uh, a single shot. Oh, I like that. Okay, I don't know. Oh. This, fire. this game has what I would describe as a bizarre amount of depth. We have learned from from people sending us pro tips in, but I don't it know. seems like it has a lot more than the original. Now, but is it depth or finickiness? You know what I mean? This is this is a terrible. I don't like this part. Like I don't know if it's depth or finick. This is a bad well, sequence. Get in there. Oh, I did it. There he just go. literally phased out of the universe. Did you see that? I saw him. Oh, they're back though. Oh, oh, oh that's how they were doing it. There. Oh. And now you got an honest to goodness fight. Oh boy. Uh, you should spell. I no, can't. You, well, yeah, you don't have enough really. Oh. Well. Can you die, please? You're fine. You're fine. Can you die, please? Thank you. Dodge that rush. Eh. Oh, there's more outside. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Kill the weaker one. He's not even weaker. Yeah, I, I barely even hit him. Oh, no. Oh, oh that Look works. at you idiots. That works. Look at that. Die, you fucks. Wait, am I supposed to do something here? Because... Easy peasy, bread and cheesy. Now... Ugh. Ugh, I'm so strong. My body's so hot. Yeah. Oh wow, they they just keep coming, just like that Shrek song, um, or that that Kojima song. That's the new one. The new one? That's the new hotness. I did it. I did it, everybody. The music. Yeah, there you go. All right, perfect. I defeated the the, the neo mitochondrial beasts. Funny how that ladder's mechanism was tied to the life of these beasts. No, it was not a mechanism. It was the guy above who was hiding from the beasts. Oh, okay. Decided to kick it down. I would like to see this triangle in- Oh my god! There it is! Still doesn't show the damage. No, but you can get- Well, I don't think you're gonna get a damage number as much as you're gonna get a rate of fire, and you know that each shot- Oh, this has the motion detector built in. And it was just silence. Ooh, yeah. that's 90 HP. Attachment. Oh, healing items um, recover less HP if they're in attachment as opposed to out in the field. Oh. That's... Um, yeah, in inflict darkness on people. Okay. Tonfa, weight range, rate. Yeah, so rate is the closest thing you have to a yeah. damage number. I have a GPS, so I don't actually need the GPS or the Tonfa. Do you not like seeing where the enemies are? But my... But my thing, my uh, my armor should have it built in. Yeah, oh. it does. Okay. And then uh, free up that slot. Get get out of here, GPS. No, get out. So are you saying that GPS? I want you to get out. That the man up there that kicked the ladder down decided to wait for the dead beasts yeah. before kicking them down, because God forbid they know how to climb a ladder. Yeah. Well, no, he's like I can't get with down. their not prehensile hands Amen. and feet. Hey man, he's not a perfect uh, guy. He probably doesn't even have. Sick mitochondrial powers. Watch you get up there and there's no one and nothing. We saw the guy. We saw him. He's like, hey, it's me. Guy without powers. It's gonna be right around here. Yeah. Told you. There you go. Uh, oh, he, a ginger. And look at him wearing his, his Square Enix vest. Yeah. <laughs> or sweater. So I he, say. that's Kyle Madigan. Okay. Like, why is a striped, not striped, but like, why is that type of sweater specific to Square Enix or yeah, Square it, Soft? Yeah, because it, it, it makes me think like uh, FF8. You think of it. You think of FF8, you think of FF7, mm -hmm. you think of all that. Oh, I like that this guy's just like, hey, what? Oh, face. Mist Hunter. 
You're not supposed to know about that, dirtbag. No, he's got a, he's got a gun strap. So is she like 35 now? Or so? Like she's forever 18. Oh, he's no, she's, she's forever 21. 20, 21. Second Good thing. in all regions. I feel like I'm gonna get into like a fist fight with Billy about Parasite Eve at some point during this LP off camera, um, where where he starts like. No, that's that's only gonna happen in third birthday. Uh, 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 um. And that's not gonna be a fist fight as much it'll be as it'll be passive aggressive editing techniques. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> where whatever no, no, you no, say. No, 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 no. Third birthday is the <laughs> best. <laughs> Just over and over. I love the yeah. third birthday. Me and Mr. Black played it over the weekend. I love Mr. Black. <laughs> he told me about the third birthday. The game that killed Parasite Eve forever. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, did you see her ankle just do an impossible freak out there? Oh, it's good. So we're just gonna team up and hang out. Mannequin. I can see the whole town from here. How romantic. Wow. What a town. <laughs> what a fuck. Why would anyone- If you live out in a town like this, like out in a dust bowl or a desert, let me know. Yeah, someone, what, someone did let us know. What's the deal with that? Someone did let us know, and they're like, yeah, it sucks, man. And I was like, <laughs> damn. Well, that's what I thought. Shit. Oh, yeah. Bro, gotta fix Oh, that. I hope a scorpion stings someone soon so we can have some excitement. Right? You can see the complete lack of mitochondria. All right, now that's a permanent one, I imagine. Hopefully. Or else I'm gonna feel really stupid. It might, it might be a battle every Wait, time. Wait, why didn't he just do that? When I was down there. Because he's a scared. Oh, uh, Kyle. Kyle, why would you do this? He's, he's I'm gonna climb to the tip of the tip tops. Yeah. So I can make a pra- a Oh. Damn. Oh, I'll take that. I'll take a key taken off a corpse. And a recovery item. I'll take all these things. Let's take a look at the key recovered from His corpse. cells were weak. And that's why the flies are feasting on him. That sucks, man. G and R. Okay, it doesn't really really mean a whole lot to me, honestly. G and R? Nothing, nothing yet. Okay, Guns and Roses. Life is all about. Is guns it the Guns and Roses, and roses key? Maybe. I don't care for Guns and Roses. I I knew you wouldn't. I think I think I, I I like the moment you made a musical reference of any kind. I think it was safe to say that you didn't actually know what you were talking about. Oh, I knew what I was talking about. Okay. I know that I'm talking about how I don't like Guns N' Roses. Okay. I Ooh. mean, who's who's in Guns N' Roses again? Uh, Axel Lowe. Uh huh. Um, yeah. Slayer. That's the one. Yeah. Um. <laughs> wow, I'm, I'm impressed. Uh, Milia Rage. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> Sh I thought I, I thought I was gonna expose you, but uh, you yeah. fucking nailed it. And it's I I'm just not a big fan of when you go to their concert, they throw their chains and shit at you, <laughs> and then they just start teleport dashing through the crowd. It's so annoying. You know, I came to a concert to enjoy music, and now I have to guess Oki, and... <laughs> <laughs> it's really annoying. Oh, that is a joke just for us. <laughs> <laughs> These mix-ups are bullshit. Just play the classic. Just play the classic. I would really like you. Uh, oh, I opened the door with saloon key. How fantastic. <laughs> oh. oh! You can tell because the shadows are all fucked up. And they were polygonal as opposed to nearly everything. What exactly. the fuck am I looking at? That, like, that was weird. So this is this is not... I'm not going to give this up to, to, to the date. I'm going to say that's just poor. Mm. Because the camera is dramatic, but you can't see what you're even shooting. Well, yeah, but I killed it in like two seconds. I know, but that sucks. <laughs> I really do like how they give us a little um, indicator of. Oh, that's what that does. It goes through the other door in the back of the factory. Yeah, there's okay. your indicator. Uh, but I absolutely adore that they give me a giant green light. Uh, sorry, red light that says, "Hey, giant refrigerator. Something on the door. This might be useful." Oh, it's a magnet. Ma Drink Coca. Cola. That's a. <laughs> what, what It'll would you call make that? your mitochondria. I would call that a hard brand. Oh man, there's no backing down from this one. That's that's built in. I wish that. Oh my god, because Square and Coke had that deal. Uh, that they would 
put their shit in everything. I wish that that bottle cap was a 404 cannot file not found <laughs> as it tries to connect to the server. That's a really good line of dialogue. That's a really good mm -hmm. line of dialogue. Check the fridge again. Yeah. Oh, contents don't look so fresh. Okay. Yeah, apparently there are, in some cases, up to three different lines. So I know that it's gonna be annoying. Dinner pills. These are pretty expensive. Guess they had the market corner. But you're gonna have to check everything constantly. Looks like that ladder's broken. Is it a ladder or is it a step ladder? Champagne. I don't care for champagne. Honestly. I like it, because I like cider. And I like, uh, and I think bubbly tastes actually pretty nice. Um... Oh. By comparison to, uh, some well, other things. Well, this is nice. I'll show a mirror finish. The body in the water tower, that was probably him. Oh, how sad. Huh? How very sad. Shame that your polishing didn't fucking keep you alive, idiot. Yeah. Can't polish off your cells. I went up there to polish off my dick. And what did I get but murdered? They polished you off. And now the flies are gonna finish the job. Those are horrific. Those are hummingbirds, but they're also bugs. babies. Yeah, that's real. Oh god, that's really gross. Cause they're half inside. I don't like that bird, at all. And they don't really care whether you know the difference. I don't. Oh yeah, boy. I know you're trying to get a better angle, but you think you should just shoot them. Oh. Hmm. Thank you, Wooly. Okay. I appreciated your advice just now. And help. Out. I'm glad that you were able to help with your cool FAQ skills. I'm helping. I'm not. I don't. I'm not. I'm not it's not actually an FAQ. Oh man, they are like. I'm just giving you general facts. Yeah, no. People were actually came out of the woodwork to be very helpful. This, that gives me the feeling that this game is somewhat beloved. So the fact that they're crawling around useless, I'm gonna have to snuff their lives out. Snuff them out. That makes me happy. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna need to upgrade that heal. Like, I really need to upgrade it quite a bit. All right, let's see. Snuff those birds. And then myself. Kill all of them. And then myself. Is that all it upgrades? That can't possibly be it. That can't possibly be how that works. Why not? By the way, did you hear about this thing? Hmm? About this screen that you're on? Did you hear about it? Uh, I heard some things. Okay, because there's a couple of things about this screen. Uh, there are, there are, uh, skills that are only worth it at level three, for example. Yes, and there are third skills that are considered broken, usually, and worth getting. Yeah, but I do not have them yet. The fire one in particular was considered a nice, good broken one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna upgrade the healing one, man. That just, I don't feel any downsides. You have a lot of experience. Damn. How much for combustion, though? Damn. I can buy that, no problem. I fucking buy it. Yeah. Do you want plasma energy shot as well? You, I mean, I don't want them, but you you need just about everything. Oh, you do? I, I mean, it would be smart to get everything, because you want the third level busted one. Oh, that's how that happens? Yeah, you have to get the rest. That's stupid. So you have to spread yourself out to max it out. Yeah, you gotta spread yourself out, girl. To max it Fire. out. Fire. Something inside the fridge. Coca-Cola! <laughs> Drink Coke. Oh, feeling so hot. Thirsty almost. Oh, parched. Mm. If only. This dry desert. Just. My throat. Oh, wow, wow. This had a lot more on it than. Yeah, one of the. Someone said that it's not unlike Dark Souls and it's just. Wow, wow, wow. Mitochondria are the powerhouse of the cell. <laughs> We know about what genes are. We know what what the uh, the that's man. Okay, so this is actually interesting. It's not a, it's not real until you see spaces between the letters. Um, let's see. Uh, over the last week of December 1997 on Manhattan, these events including mass immolations. Pat, 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 pat. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up all back, the way. Back it up. Back it up. Let's 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 read this. The Manhattan blockade incident, a popular name for the series of bizarre incidents occurring over the last week of December 1997 on Manhattan Island. Um, so that puts a weird amount of context into that, because it's like, it was, wait, was that actually limited to the, just the island of Manhattan? The entire of Parasite Eve 1 only happened on Manhattan. Yeah, but like, Burke Brooklyn was just day to day. <laughs> Everything else was fine, yes. The you know. navies in the Hudson. Oh yeah, Staten Island was fine. Okay. You know. These events, including mass immolations and the destruction of police property, ended with a forced evacuation and temporary blockade of the island. The Marines brought the situation under control, but not before the toll of dead and missing rose to 1,287 persons. That seems hilariously low. 
considering the events of Parasite Eve 1. The popping of the bodies in the big uh, Coliseum Like, I feel like there may have yeah. been over a thousand people in that thing alone. Yeah. Regardless. The official report states that a genocidal... Let me try that again. Mm -hmm. the, <laughs> the initial report... Uh, the, mm. the official report no, no, states I can that do it. I can a do geneticist, it. Dr. Hans Klaup, was solely responsible for this act of organic terrorism and the creation of the artificial virus that made it possible. He didn't create the powerhouse of the cell. No. Other sources hinted a government cover-up. That the New York police detective Aya Brea, whose heroic absence helped in the incident, was a former patient of Dr. Klaup. Oh, you corrected it to Aya this time. I don't know, man. It's I all know. over. Because we, we like saying Aya Brea, but Aya it's Brea. apparently it's Aya, like Maya. Well, yeah, because she's uh, her name is Japanese Who for no reason. Who actually cares? Um, is this funny. another one? I forget. I honestly forget. But it's, is she supposed to be a, like a second generation Japanese immigrant who oh. buys her hair? Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I remember we might have discussed that in the in based on what the book, the original. Yeah, Parasite it's super was, weird. It's but I do I do because she has a very Japanese first name. I'll take a look. Um, uh, th that the New York police detective I I fuck it, <laughs> <laughs> the hot lady whose heroic actions helped end the incident was a former patient of Doctor Klaup. Raise further suspicion of the media. Vector, the method of DNA propagation in which a section of DNA is affixed to a virus and sent into the cells of the test subjects. It's used to rebuild gene chains. Well, isn't that nice? So I'd like to think everyone out on Long Island during that incident, incident was just like, Oh, those fucking Manhattan pieces of shit. They're doing their fucking bullshit. What is that big blobby thing over there? Is that terrorism? I bet it's fucking terrorism. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Hey, Ma, we having a chicken or what? Hey, <laughs> hey, you think, hey, Jimmy, you think you can put that big blob of people on the calzone? <laughs> <laughs> Next time, bring your sister around, huh? Tell her I've been thinking about her. No time for music appreciation now, unfortunately. She smells nice. <laughs> oh, wow. What? Oh, that's awesome. And there's another Coca-Cola brand in the image. Oh, Jesus Fucking Christ. A pinball machine. It's called Einhander. Wish I had time to play a few balls. I wish you had time. Einhander's so cool. A rare model. Yeah. Damn. Hey, Aya! She you done with that blob? You got to come down to pinball camp and play a few balls? I like I got a few balls you can play with. Oh, I hate that you fuck. That's not mouth on you every time I tell you. I like that idea. Why, why is it that Italian American New Yorkers are just the funniest <laughs> fucking people in the world? Oh, no, but I also like like uh, old Irish and old old Polish and everyone that Colin Quinn makes fun of. I like I'm, I'm I'm a fan of all of that. Oh. The Dominicans dancing in the streets and everybody just being huge stereotypes. <laughs> it's it's a lot. It's Can awesome. I be a stereotype too when I grow up? No, you're from Canada. Oh, I could be like a like a Canadian. Your, can your Canadianism overrides everything else that you are, oh, which is why everyone that goes on about how Wooly's the whitest sounding black guy ever, it's like actually no, man, I'm just Canadian. And anyone that's from Canada that doesn't kind of sound I'm out of ammo. Period. Yeah, anyone that sounds like they're from New York but you're from Canada is just kind of fake. I'm guys. I'm 100 out of ammo. Well, time to pull out the tonfa. No, I will pyrokinesis you. Good traits. <laughs> well, that worked. It did work. Yeah. Back down points. Minus 10. Oh. <laughs> oh when I get, get more back down points over time for backing down. Yeah, eventually. Wait, what? They didn't wake up? That's super weird. Yeah, they, they're letting you go. Damn it. You're letting me go? <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh boy. Oh man. I'm doing really badly today. I'm you're, very bad at this You're picking up game. items. You're picking up items. Um, Can I put, just yeah. don't dead. Just don't dead. Alright, let's, uh, so recovery items heal more outside of battle, so let's, oh, it's a tasty bever- <laughs> Guys. Guys. Dude. Guys. Are we in a game in which a Coca-Cola is an ether? Guys, you didn't tell us. You didn't tell us about, about the coke. About the coke. You didn't tell us. Nobody told us about the coke. I warned you about coke, dog. I tried. <laughs> Can you go back to your bedroom and just rest to get your- I back? really thought I could. And the answer to that question is fuck me, no. Damn. Damn, that sucks, bro. I know. Wow, that cola was absurdly powerful. Well, good thing you drank Coca-Cola. Trademark. Copyright. It, re it regens fucking, um, 88 uh, MP. Of which I only have like 47 available. 
Huh. It's so strong. It's amazing. Coca-Cola is a copyright of the Coca-Cola bottling company. Oh, you, oh that, is that true? Or it's the other way around, actually. Oh. They own Sprite, and Sprite's a better product. But the Coca-Cola bottling company is not Coke. Really? What? Yeah. It's a different company. Is it true they used to put the cocaine in the Coca-Cola? I heard that that's where the name Coke came from. Is that true, though? I think it's true. Yeah. Yeah, and Pepsi owns the 7-Up. Yeah. And then you all- it all goes back to fucking Viacom or whatever. <laughs> like, whether it's GE, Viacom, or one of those other god companies. I forgot that, uh, oh god, what Minute Maid, Minute Maid, the big- I saw the big chain one time and I was like- Do you remember when Activision fucking sued Viacom for fucking up the Star Trek license? No. So act so it was this it was the craziest fucking thing. I remember when they straight they're separating and we were all oh no, it was Blizzard separating from Activision and we were like, Yeah. So here's Big what, Man, fight the even bigger man. So here's what happened. So they bought the fucking Star Trek uh, they rented the Star Trek license, I guess would mm -hmm. be more accurate. Mm -hmm. From Viacom, who owns Star Trek. And they said, We're gonna make some Star Trek games. And they made like Voyager Pers Elite Force or fucking whatever. Yep. And those games sold like fucking Dog ass, like shit, mm. shit coming out of a dog's rectum, and then as a result of that, spiral formation. In order to uh, like appease their their shareholders and all that shit, uh, people like, why did you buy the Star Trek license if it's this awful, right? They sued Viacom, saying, "Hey, fuck you, Viacom. Um, why did you ruin Star Trek with Voyager and Enterprise?" And they'll sell us something worthless. Wow. That's high level. And, um, fucking Viacom has to go to court and be like, no, en Enterprise is not worthless. Jesus. <laughs> you, like, the br you attack the brand? Yeah. That's... Ballsy. Did it work? I don't think so, but I bet it made Activision investors happy because they were doing something. Oh, there we go. Did it? Does poison persist? Let's find out. That's a good test. Oh, I got some hydras. So, here's something that we should have paid more attention to, and what that is, is that enemies will respawn, but they will not respawn infinitely. Um... But when we- I saw someone laugh at the- at the remark that I said like, Hey, I wonder if you can grind in this game. The, the reason why they laughed is because you can't. Because there is a finite amount of enemies in the entire game. Right? So, after every story of- Oh, I'm gonna vomit. Oh, boy. Uh, gonna vomit right into the- right onto this nice microphone. I wonder what that would sound like. Oh, that's actually interesting. I kinda want- The experiment wanna, might be I kinda it. wanna do it. The experiment. I kind of want to do it for fun. Hmm. Vomiting for fun and pleasure. Um, why is this red? Why is this room red? <laughs> it's only it's only one place it's gonna come out of. Oh. 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 Hmm. I was gonna say the toilet. Are those? Those can't be infants. They're not humans. They just have. That's to. way too. That would be. Like, oh, that's our little tutorial for the way these enemies work. They they pop. If you shoot a baby, oh, it pops. God. All right. I is just. We're just. We're just killing babies. With, oh, I got a flare with our baby skull tracking bullets. Oh yeah, you watch that <laughs> clip, huh? We are just aiming right at them. Oh boy. What a what a no! Not even a flinch so on her. Right? There's this gang, right? Yeah, and and what do they got? They got baby skulls around their necks. Mm, them bikers, huh? If you want, if you want to fucking check out some really fucking absurd sketch comedy, you need to check out the fucking whitest kid you, know. you know. Yeah. Also, great name for a sketch group. Yeah. Uh, the fucking the fucking bit where the kid's parents die and he just goes on this freewheeling adventure around town, drinking booze and putting fucking um. He puts fucking chocolate syrup in malt liquor, cause fuck you, my parents are dead. Right. People, people keep coming up to him and going, "Damn you!" And then at the end, a cop walks by and goes, 
hey kid, what are you doing? Hanging out with black people. And he does like a hip hop pose. <laughs> and him and the black guy look like, oh, and the cock goes, ooh, you kids. And then they do a fist bump, right? Yeah. And then, and here's where the bit takes a weird turn. Then it cuts to Derek in his house talking to the camera like, Hey, I bet you wonder. Oh, and then the kid pops out of existence. He just disappears from right. the frame. I, you're, I bet you're wondering how we were able to do that. Well, via the magic of special effects, I'll show you. And then it cuts to them in a fucking mocap studio and says, See, through the magic of television, what we were able to do was film me in a green screen and the black actor several miles away. <laughs> so I was never in danger. <laughs> They do, they do a bunch of skits like that that just like, they just go and go and go in these weird, weird places. Oh, that's fantastic. That oh, boy. Excellent. Hey, kid, what are you doing? Hanging out with black people. Where are your parents? They're dead. Oh, hi there. My name's Trevor Moore. I'm the actor who played Scotty in that last video. Now, you're all probably wondering how we managed to pull that sketch off. And the answer lies in good old-fashioned Hollywood magic. Through new amazing technology, I was filmed in front of a blue screen while the black actor was filmed elsewhere. Then my image was put together with the black person's image later in post-production. That's right. Due to modern miracles, I was able to record that sketch safely on a secured soundstage, while the black actors were actually filmed many miles away. I was never in harm's way for a moment. Isn't technology wonderful?